Hello everyone. Today I will give a speech on deep learning prediction. <coughs> the topic of the speech is PM fuel cell degradation prediction by long short term memory network. My report will be divided into three parts. The first part will introduce the research background. Energy problem is an important link in the development of human society and the guarantee of sustainable. After many times of energy conversion, only about 35% of the energy of traditional vehicle is used. Compared with the traditional energy, fuel cell emit less greenhouse gas have high energy conversion efficiency, stable operation and low working noise. As vehicle energy, it has high power density, low operating temperature, short startup time and norm at normal temperature. The reaction of the fuel cell is shown in the figure. In order to provide power, when oxygen and hydrogen diffuse to the surface of memory electrode, oxidation reaction and reduction reaction will occur into two stages respectively. At present, PEM fuel cell has made breakthrough progress in energy efficiency, power density, low temperature startup, and other performance indicators. However, the current mass production cost of PEM fuel cell system is $49 per kilowatt, and the survival life is generally 2,500 hours. There is a slow gap between the commercial cost index. Cost and life are the important factors restricting the commercialization of PEM fuel cell. The exchange memory, catalyzer, bellpler plate, memory electrode is an important component affecting the cost and performance of fuel cell. The direct cause of performance degradation of PEM fuel cell is the pollution, the degradation of critical materials including the electrode memory, electrode catalyst, resulting in the decrease of proton conductivity of the memory. The change of the electrode structure, resulting in the gradual degradation of battery performance. For fuel cell vehicles, operating conditions have a great impact on the survival life of PEM fuel cell. The degradation of proton exchange memory catalyst is accelerated due to high operating power and current discharge. The system emergency stop will cause physical damage to the proton memory, and the change of operating conditions will cause uneven distribution and aggravate the corrosion of catalyst. Multiple startup and shutdown of the system will lead to the formation of hydrogen X oxygen interface at anode, resulting in the thinning of cathode layer and the degradation of PEM performance. The emergence of PEM fuel cell performance and life prediction technology is of a great significance to improve the durability of PEM fuel cell. Because of the complex mechanism inside and the copying of parameters, it is difficult to construct an accurate mechanism model to describe the degradation of PEM fuel cell. The prediction method based on data-driven has better nonlinear fitting ability. In this section, we first conduct three groups of durability tests under different conditions. System parameters and test conditions are shown in the figure. 
The durability test time of three groups was 375 hours, 183 hours, 556 hours. Three groups of durability test were carried out under two working conditions, in which the state, steady state working condition includes through three power points and the NEDC dynamic working condition include 36 power points. Compared the degradation trend of the system through two different operating conditions. The voltage degradation trend of durability test is shown in the figure. The data are processed according to the cycle conditions and the steady state operating points of each working condition is extracted. The operating conditions of durability test are constantly changing under the actual operating conditions. Therefore, the changes of subsystem parameters are monitored in the real time. In the third part, we use the long short term memory natural network to predict the degradation of PEM fuel cell compared with the traditional recurrent natural network. Long short term memory can prevent the gradient explosion or gradient disappearance caused by the increase of training time and network layers. The long short term memory natural network is composed of forgetting forget gate, input gate, output gate. The degradation and failure of fuel cell during operation cannot be directly obtained by signal, so the voltage is usually be selected and in addition to voltage, air inlet pressure air flow rate, cooling water inlet temperature are also predicted as input variables. Considering the dynamic behavior of the system during operation, start-stop times, fault emergency stop times are also used as inputs for prediction. So, we predict the future degradation trend based on the past behavior and performance indicators. The fuel cell prediction steps based on long short-term memory are shown in the figure. As first, the data are processed according to different cycles, and the performance index of system such as air inlet pressure cooling water inlet temperature and voltage under each cycle. In the second, we call start and stop, both emergency stop and other behaviors in each cycle and the durable cycle. At the last, set parameters such as the number of hidden layers and iteration steps, initial learning rate and dropout. The durability data of PEM fuel cell in durability tests are trained and prediction results are verified. The results are shown in the figure. In the first group of data, we compared the effects of two prediction methods. The prediction result of behavior based on natural network is better than the non-behavior natural network. Our method have good fitting performance for system dynamic behavior data. In the second group of data, its operating condition is still steady, steady state, and we adjust the air slow geometry. In the prediction effect, the effect of behavior based natural network is also better than the non-behavior prediction method. The third group of durability tests 
adopts any DC dynamic working condition, and its start, up, shutdown, and fault are more frequent. The voltage fraction is more thorough, so the behavior based the natural network can better predict the system degradation. The fitting effect of the test data is always improved. These are all the claims of my report. Thank you for listening.